We present Unreal Eagle, a new large-scale naturalistic dataset for egocentric 3D human pose estimation. Unreal Eagle offers eyeglasses-based stereo images and a wider variety of motion that can be seen in daily human activities. Egocentric 3D human pose estimation has been actively researched recently. Compared to cumbersome motion capture systems that require fixed recording volume, the egocentric setup is more suitable to capture daily human activities in unconstrained environments. Example applications include Excel technologies, motion analysis for sports and health, to name a few. Existing egocentric datasets have several limitations when capturing daily human motions. MotoCap2 and XIGO pose propose monoclear setups. However, their datasets are created by compositing people on background images. Because of such composition, they do not capture accurate geometry changes of surrounding 3D environments. Also, they contain limited types of simple motions, which is not suitable to capture a wider variety of motions that are usually seen in daily life. On the other hand, EagleCap and EagleGlass introduce stereo setups. In particular, EagleGlass proposes a mobile eyeglasses-based setup, which is convenient and ideal to capture daily human motions compared to other setups. However, their datasets are captured only in studio environments, and their motion variety is quite limited. Furthermore, there are currently no large-scale stereo datasets publicly available. To address these challenges, we introduced the Unreal Legal dataset. Our Unreal Legal dataset is based on the advanced concept of eyeglasses that can be used in unconstrained environments of daily lives. Firstly, we use Unreal Engine to design their virtual prototype with two fisheye cameras equipped on the glasses frames. We then attach them to 3D human models to capture stereo views in various 3D environments. We summarize the key differences between existing dataset and Unreal Eagle. We propose a compact eyeglasses-based setup for in-the-wide stereo view capture. Similar to Eagle Glass, our cameras are placed closer to the head. Unreal Eagle contains the largest number of egocentric images, 900,000 images in total. Also, Unreal Eagle provides the largest number of key points among existing datasets. Because of our rendering process in the 3D environments, we are able to capture natural image sequences in both indoor and outdoor scenes. More importantly, Unreal Eagle offers the widest range of motions that can cover daily human activities. Please see our main paper for more detail. Here, we show example scenes with realistic 3D human models. To animate the human models, we first create a large corpus of motion dataset that contains daily human motions ranging from simple to highly complex motion, such as talking, crouching, sitting, dancing, to name a few. Then we randomly play the human models on the ground in a wider variety of 3D environments with different time of day and night as shown in the video. Here, we show the rendered egocentric views from our device. Multiple characters are captured in some views. Please see our main paper for more detail. Motion diversity is our top priority. Here, we visualize the distributions of head key points in the existing dataset XIGO pose and our proposed Unreal Eagle. The coordinate system is relative to the pelvis. The head positions of XIGO pose are relatively fixed above the pelvis, whereas Unreal Eagle shows the more widespread distribution. Example most challenging motions of Unreal Eagle include jumping, exercising, and dancing. We also show the distributions of the left foot. Again, compared to the existing dataset, the key points of Unreal Eagle are more widespread, even above the pelvis. This suggests that Unreal Eagle contains motions with a wider variety of left foot positions. Here, we visualize example motions, such as backflip, sliding, and standing. We also propose a new benchmark method on Unreal Eagle, which achieves the state-of-the-art results and outperforms existing method. We follow a traditional two-step approach in human pose estimation. Firstly, we use stereo egocentric views as inputs. These images are then processed in the 2D module to estimate heat maps of key point locations. Here, we use two weight-shared encoders pre-trained on ImageNet and one decoder. 
Firstly, the two weight shared encoders encode the input fields into feature maps at each layer. These feature maps are concatenated along with the channel dimensions at each layer and forwarded into corresponding decoder layers to output heat maps. The estimated heat maps are further processed in the 3D module. The 3D module first encodes the heat maps to get embedding features, which are used in two decoder branches. The first branch is a 3D pulse branch, which outputs the final 3D pulse. The second branch is a heat map branch, which tries to reconstruct the predicted 2D heat maps so that the network can capture the uncertainty of the heat maps. Then we trained each module separately. We provide a quantitative result on the Unreal Eco test split. Here, we also show the effect of ImageNet pre-training for the encoder backbone. Please note that none of the previous works released their source code. Therefore, we re-implemented their method. We show the qualitative results. Compared to the existing method, our approach constantly generates accurate 3D poses, even when the lower body part is out of image range. In some complex motions in a brighter environment, our method still accurately predicts 3D poses. Overall, our method is better visual output than the existing method. However, there are some failure cases where all methods struggle with the severe occlusions in the images. This suggests some future research directions, such as taking into account temporal context. Here, we show more results of pose predictions from our method. Again, our method shows promising results even on the highly complex motion sequence. We believe that Unreal Ego and our proposed benchmark method will accelerate future research in the egocentric field. Thank you for watching our video. Unreal Ego and source codes are available on our project page.